Hello everybody! Today I would like to share with you something that just came up like half an hour ago in my discussion with my friend and collaborator Iris and it has to do with the way that human beings work when they leave that pressure of having to do things and that pressure of having to make sense <laughs> in what we are discussing aside and allow that magic of human connection to actually step into our professional life and we started our discussion as we normally do so what we basically are creating together is an online authentic relating circle where people get together and explore what is arising in their bodies, in their minds, in their emotions and authentically express that in the present moment to each other. And this is how we begin every discussion we have between ourselves for whatever topic there is. And today we started that and we found out very quickly that both of us were feeling very overwhelmed with all these things we wanted to do and with this thought that we need to figure out a way to focus and direct our attention on what makes sense and, and like start making it and start doing it it was like a lot of like pressure like this that we both brought up to the conversation and as we were expressing that she shared this image of a mouse that she just saw in, in, in her mind's eye um, that was sort of related to that feeling and and when I heard that I immediately saw it in front of me as well and I saw that mouse and it was very agitated and like you know and it was like its whole being was about fear I asked myself like is there a way that that mouse can behave somehow else <laughs> and the moment I asked that I saw that mouse like kind of taking up this position and going into meditation mode it was like this really funny Zen mouse that was just sitting there and being super chill. And so I realized there was this snake approaching. And the snake was like basically this all oh, these external pressures and and worries and things that needed to be done. That was like kind of how it felt energetically to me that it represented those things. And so he was approaching the mouse and he just stood there like sort of confused. <laughs> By what the fuck was wrong with this mouse? There was this still moment in which nothing was happening. And that still moment was like, oh, there is a relationship here. And so far, that relationship has been the relationship that was like making sense of like, oh, I, I need to do these things and I need to run away so I can escape this snake that wants to catch me. You know, that these external pressures. But now it was like the mouse all of a sudden was in control of the situation and it, it was having this power. Iris reflected back that she felt like the snake was having this agenda, you know, and, and like somehow that agenda was getting, you know, the mouse really sort of stressed in a way um, and was the core of what was bugging us and what was holding us back. And as she shared that, she shared maybe it's about like being authentic about that agenda, about what is it, this value that we want to create for other people. And actually that is a reflection of what is this value we want to create for ourselves here in this space that we are creating. And also being authentic for this other aspect of it, that it is a business, you know, and just, just stating that out loud as it is and I had this image of like the mouse sort of going into one of those sw swinging things that kids use that it's like a stick and each of them kind of bounces off on each side and so like the mouse sort of cr crawled up to to one side of this and and like the the snake started just like <laughs> with with its tail like bumping on the other side and going up and down and they started playing like this with each other and and all of this you know transformed into this really beautiful deep calm space of awareness and of inspiration we found out basically that 
so far we've let our rational minds lead our business related discussions where actually there is this completely different approach in which we can step into this space in which all we pay attention to is ourselves and the way we relate to one another and empowering each other in that space and once we've done that stepping out of that space with that inspiration with that drive with that new insight that we've gained this abstract sort of creative field and taking that and each of us finding our own way to transform it into something practical on whatever it is that we have taken up as responsibility in our business related work and that was like such a huge shift for me it felt like some kind of jigsaw puzzle just falling into place and finding its exact spot that it has to rest for us to really create from a space of alignment and power with each other and it was such a beautiful experience and I felt like I wanted to share with you guys like you know that there is this way in which you can work with one another in which you step into your discussions not in order to clarify the fucking details of what needs to happen but to actually create a space of empowerment for each other with which you come out and you just go and you just what do what the fuck you whatever the fuck you want that you've been inspired to do with that energy and that's fucking amazing and i would really recommend you guys to try that out if you're interested in, in joining our circle, I would love to have you there. Just reach out. It's going to be this Sunday. And yeah, love you guys. Thank you for tuning in. Have an amazing day.